What are the chances Donaldson is a Blue Jay come 2018 opening day? I'm going to say it's 50%. Fitty fitty? I think it's fitty fitty. I think Josh Donaldson not being a member of the Blue Jays is way more of a possibility going into 2018 than we think at this point. Now, why do we think that? Because every time you hear Ross Atkins speak on 2018, and every time you hear Mark Shapiro speak on 2018, yep. they are painting a picture that they'll add a couple more pieces to the lineup, the pitching they're happy with, and they should, health permitting, make a run back to the postseason. They believe that things didn't go their way. They think Devin Travis is going to stay healthy first season with no record to back that up. They think Tulo's going to come back. If you add a few more pieces, maybe you can do it because those next guys, those kids, McCall, they're not major league ready yet. No. They're not there, right? Like you have the major league team and you have like Bo and Vladdy and double A, right. right? I think the offers they may get for Josh Donaldson entering the final year of his deal are going to be better than they think. Major League ready player, couple prospects-ish. And this is now the second time we've seen this rumor. J.P. Morosi earlier in the year, yep. and now a guy like Nightingale, and, and Nightingale doesn't just throw stuff around either. So I think it's 50-50 whether Josh Donaldson is going to be a Blue Jay because Let me ask you I question. think they remember how Edwin went, and I think there's some scared people in the organization that if that goes that way, you don't have a PR department strong enough to get you through that storm. Let me ask you a question. Let me let me ask you a question. Ask me a question. Is there any way the Jays contend or at least present themselves as contenders without Josh Donaldson in the lineup in 2018? Depends on the return, but I think it's tough to do. I think it's very tough to present 2018 in that light if you trade a guy who two seasons earlier was American League MVP. I think it's tough. It's very tough. It would depend on the return. You're right. But, but, but what kind of return? But we can work out what that return would be, right? No. It's not just going to be kids because the Jays can't do that in 2018. It's not just going to be ready-made guys well, because could. Donaldson's in a walk year sure and St. Louis doesn't have to give up all those prospects. No, sure, sure it could. They, they could do whatever the hell they want. We've walked down this path before. If they so choose to trade him, they could trade him for just prospects. If you got the right haul of prospects, why would you – had the, uh, I don't know, the suitable replacement for Josh Donaldson? Like, what is that? Where are you getting that? Well, the replacement's already there in Vladi. He's just not ready yet. No, no, I know. Yeah. But I'm saying, you're saying you'd have to get the guy that would replace him for 2018. Yeah. But or the, you just don't. Or you, well, but this or you is just the, get a really this good is, haul. This is the corner of you've prospects. kind of painted yourself in, though, right? Like, that's, the, that's been part of my problem with this narrative. You know, last offseason starts. We need to get younger. We need to get quicker. Blah, blah, blah. What, but what are you going to say? Didn't Say we'll see how the offseason goes. Don't say we plan on contending in 2018 when you've been in last every well, day. They, That's they, a ridiculous thing to well, say, But they do plan on contending. That, I don't care what they're plan, might, plan on one day flying. It ain't going to happen. That might change on December 13th. That could change. Right? You never know. It could change on April 12th. Like, whatever is the date, there is going to be a shift here. You know it. Damn Skippy. I know it. Damn Skippy. And Mark Shapiro and Ross Atkins know it, too. But they just can't say it yet. There's but some common sense here. They can here. say it in no, a different some way. Common, they right? are saying no, it in a different way. They're you saying, just have to read they're saying the lines. we have to compete in 2018. That's what they're saying. It's they, black and white. No, they're that's not, what they're saying. No, they're saying we no, like to but compete. I don't know why they're saying it, but that's what they're saying. And it's tough that We'd if you trade like your guy. we to compete in 2018. That's a better way to phrase it. Uh, we're, more on this later with Zani and Jamie. They're going like to join we, us, Can right? we stop and recognize that it's all BS? And if they get the right haul, the guy's moving. Even if it's just kids. You think, even if it's just kids. If they get the right haul... They'll move them. Even if it's just kids. Yeah, so if they well. get the right. So I'm with him. If it's the kids, I don't care. No, you want your team but to be good But if everyone's really long concerned term. about 900000 a night on TV and $3 million in the stands, I don't know how you're going to do that. Mm -hmm. But I don't care about that. You don't care about that. Listen, I love Jose Batista, but everyone cared about bringing Jose Batista back. How did that work out for yeah, you? Exactly. Right? Come on. At some point, she's going to move on. Oh, but there was yelling and screaming, bring him back, bring him back, bring him back, bring him back. Got to bring him back. Have to bring him back. The, the top of the brass was apparently the ones that helped bring him back. Somebody said bring him back. And the guy hits 203. 